hi guys welcome back to my channel it is a girl tina as you guys can tell by the title of this video guys this is my updated eyebrow tutorial that has been long overdue like girl friend what's going on it was good in the hood i'm actually really so excited to be filming this video for you guys because i know for a fact that there's so many people out there that struggle doing the eyebrows and i was also once upon a time a person that used to struggle doing the eyebrows and i learned how to do my eyebrows so i also want to teach people out there to also learn how to do their eyebrows um this is basically my indent tutorial and how to get them done i'm so excited to be filming this video for you guys because like oh my gosh i cannot believe it okay so do make sure you guys stick around don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel and with that further said or do let us get into the video when i'm done i don't want no kiss text my phone new number i'm gonna be using my morphe eyebrow gel As you guys can see, I filled in about three quarters of my eyebrows and I did not fill in the front section of my eyebrows because I wanted to create that ombre effect so that my eyebrows can look snatched, honey. So guys, I'm going to be using the Elego Pro Concealer to outline my eyebrows as well as that flat brush. Oh yes, before I forget, so while you're, while you're outlining your eyebrows, do make sure that it is arched at the end or should I say it's sharp at the end. And if there's any concealer that is left behind, do make sure that you blend it out, honey. Because sometimes it can be very visible and just doesn't look neat. And I really feel like that is very, very essential. So guys, I use the LA Girl Pro Concealer to outline above my eyebrows as well as beneath my eyebrows. But if you're new to doing eyebrows and I prefer you um, use a concealer of your skin tone or use a darker concealer or a foundation of your skin tone. Because I remember when I used to do, I was still learning how to do my eyebrows. I remember I used to use a concealer that was two shades lighter than my lighter than my skin. And whenever I put my foundation on, it'd be very, very hard for me to blend it out because the concealer was too light. So I prefer you just rather use this, um, a foundation of your skin tone or a dark concealer so that it makes it easier for you to blend the concealer or the foundation into your skin and so that your makeup can look flawless to the T. so guys i'm going to be using that small brush to just like blend out the concealer and stuff and then i'm going to go in there with a beauty blender um, i'm just going to blend out the concealer for the final intro so that you guys can see what my eyebrows are up to honey um do make sure you focus on the uni brow because like sometimes guys um you leave it there and the next thing it just looks funny so just blend out that section to make sure it's blended out and then obviously the um the beauty blender took away some of of the of my eyebrows so what i did is i took this fully and brushed out my hairs again so that it can come back to life honey as you guys can see my eyebrows are looking snatched <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Ooh, these eyebrows are looking snatched thank you guys so much for watching if you do like these eyebrows don't forget to like comment and subscribe share this video to as much as people as you can especially people that need it because like once upon a time i needed it too so yes thank you guys so much for watching and i'm gonna be seeing you guys in the next one bye <laughs>